What's up guys, welcome to another YouTube video. My name is Fanov and like I had said in a few uh, a, a video a few days ago <laughs> we are struggling, we are not making ad revenue. I can't believe, I had to look back and see when was the last time I did a react on this channel it was like 7 months ago. I, I had to look and see how much I'm making each each month each month as somebody who makes reacts guys and As something that could be added on is like a side thing. I think it's not that bad of a thing. So I figured, hey, let's let's get back into it. I'm nervous about getting back into it. So hey, I've been looking up how to make like quick recipes at home. So let's see. This one, guys. One minute microwave mug cake recipes. Three back to school treats. Let's check it out, guys. <laughs> Today we're making, not one, not two, but three amazing one minute microwave mug cakes. These are quick and satisfying. Make these after school, after work, or any time you need a quick fix. Okay, so we're gonna make all three at the same time. I don't wanna be wasting your time because this method is pretty straight. Okay, so I've been looking up recipes a lot and the, mo the main issue with me and this recipe is the fact that everything is from scratch and I don't have all the ingredients from scratch or whatever but let's see what the ingredients are for each one there should, seems to be three different ones guys here so forward and very similar for all three we're going to melt the butter with the vanilla directly in the mug or teacups if you're using teacups please make sure they're bigger than mine otherwise it's gonna be hell to mix this so the first two i've added the sugar i'm using white for the vanilla confetti one and brown <coughs> sugar for the chocolate chip one but use whatever you got whatever you prefer <coughs> give these a quick mix and we're gonna move over to the chocolate mug cake before we add the sugar we're just gonna bloom the cocoa powder this just means adding cocoa powder to any type of hot liquid to dissolve it and bring out and intensify its delicious chocolate flavor if you're new to my channel welcome hello there make sure to subscribe and click that notification bell i post new videos every week i've gone ahead see that's what every other recipe is calling for water instead of milk i was like yo let's add freaking water milk instead of water you know what i'm saying but yeah i'm not I, I'm not really in the mood to bake a whole sheet of freaking brownie like brownies like the brownie mix either has guys that's what a couple hundred at least a thousand thousand calories so <clears throat> this is why this is why for me just something quick quick dessert a bunch of sugar here to get from the milk as well <sighs> Is all the other stuff in here. Added and added some warm milk to each mug. Do not add cold milk, otherwise the butter is just gonna. I don't think I'd add sugar though. Seize up, and you're gonna get lumps, and nobody wants a lumpy cake batter. So please heat the milk. I feel like you're not going to do it, but please do it, okay? As you can see, these recipes contain no eggs, which means drum roll, please. <laughs> that they're easily veganizable. Add the flour and baking powder. I have previously mixed the two together. It's not necessary, but it really does help because you'll avoid overmixing your cakes. This is why it's better to just use a bigger mug, okay? It's just, you know, easier than these. Where you get one of those electronic mixers. Tiny cups. I did get creative though. You know, I just busted out my mixer. This is my normal mixer with just one attachment. And no, you don't need a mixer, okay? You can just use a fork. However, if you do use a fork, make sure you scrape the bottom. Definitely gotta have the right size freaking mug cake for that, or a mug for that as well. That's a lot of ingredients though. I wanna make something smaller. Guys, this is a lot of the mugs with a spatula okay so at this point we're ready to cook these babies this video is done don't don't actually no that's a decent size like oh i have two crucial tips yeah we're gonna try and make something like this put your mug in the center of the microwave and the second most important tip is to not overcook your mug cake like i can't believe that i have never tried this in my life like one day in the pantry there was something like this but it didn't work so good it seems perfect right <clears throat> So clean the edges. I keep seeing this repeatedly. We will be cleaning the edges for sure then. We don't want that. 
because we had made our own peanut butter cookies and we forgot to adjust the edges. It cleans, it cooks like an oven then. It cooks in like an oven. Cook your mug cake for exactly mm. one minute. I will leave more tips in the description box and on my website. Okay, so fast forward one minute later and boom, you got yourself a delicious mug cake, or in my case, three cakes. These are great as is. Mm. If you want to add some frosting on top, by all means, go ahead. I do like to serve my chocolate mug cake with some of that on top, and I highly recommend you do that as well because it's delicious. Whichever mug cake you decide to make, all three are incredibly soft and fluffy and absolutely delicious. Make these on weekday as an after school treat for a late night break. Something about uh, making something from scratch, or almost like from scratch, or just cooking in general just makes me nervous. I don't know. Just don't want to mess it up, you know. You also have like food there. It can be, you know. Got the clean up over there. So it's like, you know. Something always makes me nervous about the process of food and eating. Let me know if you guys feel similarly. And let me know if you ever tried a mug cake, because I'm seriously, uh, it make sure milk is warm. Okay. Well, <clears throat> I didn't even pay attention to that, guys, so I will definitely be making sure the milk is warm. Uh, Did she add the stuff in the middle? Or just on the top? <clears throat> she mixed it in. Okay, well we can do either, but it's like quite efficient. Three recipes in one, guys. 5.8 mil views three years ago. Check them out in the description, like, comment, subscribe. See you guys next one. Peace out. And yeah, I will be trying this out, guys.